Hi, this is uh, James with Spectrum Glasses, and I'll be showing you how to make one of our new displays. All the pieces and tools you will need are included in the retail display box that you have received. Start by placing two wooden pegs into the larger holes of each of the arc side pieces. The next step is to attach the grey rectangular piece that will be the bottom of the display. Attach it to one of the arcs using the wooden pegs you just inserted. Make sure you have the unfinished back of the display lining up so you don't have it backwards. Then attach the other rectangular wooden piece in the same way, making sure again that the sides match up. After this is completed, you can add the second arc on the other end, uh, lining up the holes and wooden pegs again. Now we add two screws in the smaller holes and screw them in with the included Allen key. Then flip the display over and do the same thing on the other side. Flip the display over and we can add four rubber feet to the bottom of the display. This helps the display uh, stop sliding if it's on a count, slippery surface like a counter. For the next part, we will use these small screws and be screwing them into the pre-drilled holes on the back of the display. You can see the holes here and here. So line up the holes on the large back piece and use the small screws to attach it. There will be four total screws and you can use the included Allen key which has a screwdriver on the other end or use your own screw. Now it's time to put on the finishing touches. To keep the brochures in place you can attach these walls to separate them from the rest of the display. Then add hooks to keep the glasses in place and show them off. Lastly, if your display is on a high shelf where it is hard to read, we have included a piece that can hang over the ledge. If you would like to attach it, just use the adhesive on the back to attach it to the front of the display, like so.